the best of times and the worst of times, that pretty much sums up Twitter's somethic life. And if you really pay attention, this decade is also a time to learn some crucial, and sadly, often rather cruel, life lessons to take into your 30s and beyond. Strap yourselves in, some of this advice might be a little bit hard to swallow. Your 20s are experimental years. Building years risk years. Try it all full and then keep doing the good stuff. How much do you value one of your hours? If someone offers you work for less than that number, decline. If it will cost you less to hire someone else to do what needs to get done than what it would cost you at your valued rate, hire them. Value your time. Got sick. Broke a leg. Fell on your face. Nobody cares, especially when it comes to work and business. Well, that's not true, if you work with good people, they care. But they also don't they expect you will keep to your word and get done what needs to get done, or pass it off to someone else who can finish the job. Most fights stem from a lack of communication. Fires, lack of communication. Misunderstandings, lack of communication. If you feel like you are over communicating, you probably are, and that's a good thing. Listen, the understated importance of doing things you're bad at. Post continues below. Your bar friends are your bar friends. Your workout friends are your workout friends. Your music friends are your music friends. If you find someone who you are friends with regardless of what you do together, that's a real friend. Prioritize them. I know it seems like everyone graduated, got jobs with six-figure salaries and bought palatial apartments, but that really isn't the case. Their fabulous outfits were probably bought on sale and their parents helped pay for their Fiji holidays. Don't worry, they are all just as lost as you are. Building on number six, everyone seems super together. Everyone seems to have a plan. Everyone seems to know exactly where they are going. Sit down with a person for a one-on-one -on -one dinner, and they'll probably reveal to you their long list of fears and anxieties. Don't worry it's a Twitter somethic thing. Seriously get yourself together. Or using the wrong your slash your. You sound like a 13 year old. It's time to stop. If you leave work, go home and do nothing but watch Netflix and you're still in your 20s, imagine what your life is going to be like in your 50s. Really boring get a hobby. Being vulnerable is cool. Express who you are. It's the fastest way to attract the people you truly want to be around, and weed out the ones you don't. Anytime someone promises you anything, just chalk it up to extra credit if it happens. Don't count on it. Learn to stand on your own two feet and make moves on your own. There is no hey, one day, I am going to catch my break. Something is just going to happen. Nah doesn't work that way. You either wake up every day banging down that door until it opens, or it stays shut forever. Up to you. Play the long game. A lot of things seem like good ideas in the moment. If you get the sense it's a poor choice in the long run, it probably is. 